Hey people, welcome back. And in this lecture, we will learn what is local component and how we implement that. So first of all, let's go over main.js file. In this file, you will find import of view and import of app. Now let's first talk about that view import, which will import view in our app. And then this app is this app.view file. And then we are instancing our view instance from here. And this is just line saying production tip set to false. Okay, so now how can we implement local components? For that, let's first go over components folder where you will find one component hello world.view already created. But to make it simple and easy, I'm gonna create new file which will be our component so I will name it demo and this file must end with dot view okay so now we have our file and this file will have template then script and then style tag best practice is you can put script or template like this or like this whatever you like and style will be always in the end now template will contain our html part so let's say i am in demo file i will be local component okay so this is our demo.view file and now let's go over this app.view which is entry point and here as we have this simple image now to make our demo.view file our local component in this app.view file don't get confused take a breath and listen now i want to create local component so i will write script tag and I will import demo from demo.view and this will import my demo file and now I will use sorry I can't see my keyboard behind this mic export default and here I will register this component as local component and for that I will write components and it is an object and we will pass demo and that's it we registered our demo as a local component but there's one more thing we have to render it in our app.view and for that we will use demo just like this or you can do like this whatever you like let's keep it like this now if i save and make sure there's no error in here and that's because path is not correct so it is in components and demo.view okay no errors and now if I visit this link I get I am in demo file I will be local component so this is how you can register components locally first import them then register them and then render them now let's go over this demo.view file unlike our jsfiddle examples where if I want to display some data I just use data property but here you have to use export default then data which will be a function and this function must return an object and here you will define your values and properties so let's say count set to 0 and now I can render this here count and it is count 
okay so it looks perfect should we have any errors no okay let's run it uh oh we got an error saying component template should contain only exact one root element so what you learn this template tag should have only one root element and in our example we have p and h1 which are two elements so we can wrap them in div just like this and now we have single root element and now it shouldn't give us any errors fine let's run it count zero perfect in my future videos i won't define data function like this instead i will use data then brackets and this will works fine no errors and be sure to check console we shouldn't have any errors also no errors you are clean and as we progress in this course you will learn more about this expert default what it contains how you write your styles more on template tag if we are missing something so that's it for now if you really like my lectures don't forget to support me subscribe do patreon paypal whatever you like thank you very much for watching this video and see you in the next one